Hi there, this is Jacob Land Sykes D, and this is How to Date Like a Pro. I know a lot of you are kind of nervous and need help for and tips for dating people, so I thought it would help. And after you follow my videos, you'll be such a good dater, people would swear that you're a professional. Now, a little about me. And I don't mean to brag, but I've had lots of girlfriends. I've had so many girlfriends, it's getting hard to count. I've had almost three girlfriends, some of which I've dated for almost four weeks. Anyway, this will be a quick overview and then I'll go more in depth in future videos. One of the most important things for dating someone is that you ask them beforehand. If you just show up at their door and haven't asked them on a date, um, nine, out of, nine times out of ten, they probably won't go on the date with you. Um, the next tip is remember to pick them up. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty important. But what do I wear, you might be asking. Good question. Um, here, I have some examples. A shirt like this is perfect for a more casual date because it lets her know that you're up to date with popular culture. A shirt like this is perfect because it has dragons on it. It also shows you're interested in other cultures. It's also good because it's red in case you get spaghetti sauce or get blood on it. Never mind, you shouldn't be getting blood on it. Anyway, you may be asking what should the two of us talk about? The important thing is to listen and um, think about interesting things about yourself. Um, they say don't use your cell phone when you're on a, a date and for the most part it's true but with one exception. Um, sometimes I'll have my friend call and um, be like oh I have to take this and then be like oh thank you for this award. I am so honored that you're giving me $4,000, but I don't want the money, um, so please give it to charity. And you hang up, and she'll never know it was actually your friend and not uh, a charity organi or a award organization. Good tip to keep in mind. Um, also remember, think about nonverbal communication is really important. 90% um, of communication is nonverbal communication. Um, so on an ideal date, 10% should be talking and 90% should be silence. Another tip is Grow as much, grow quite a bit of facial hair, and show a little chest hair, because um, otherwise she might tell you you look like a ten-year-old boy. Um, if you can't grow an amazing beard like I can, um, a, a little eyeliner just kind of rubbed in will do pretty well. Make eye contact, but don't be creepy. Um, if you hold eye contact for longer than five seconds, that's creepy. So I, I usually do almost that, kind of like this. Here, I'll demonstrate. And of course, don't forget to smile and nod quite often. Uh, now it's time to pick up the tip, but what do you do? This is a hard 
question because people expect different things. This is where nonverbal communication um, comes really important. What I usually do is I stare at them waiting for a cue and 20-30 seconds later they'll give you a clue of what they want to do and guess what like 90% of the time turns out that they want to pick up their half of the check okay I'll have lots of more videos with my dating tips but that just kind of rounds off the first tips so thanks for watching um, please subscribe over here and I'll talk with you next week. Thanks.